Hello from my new house and my half painted office. Also, I'm sitting on Nick's cajon. Maybe if you're lucky, you'll get a private concert. That's crooked. It feels like it's been absolutely forever since I filmed, so give me a break. I might be a little rusty. <sighs> this is a video that has been like three or four weeks in the making. It is just pure let's play with hair content. Sometimes I just feel like I need to do that. And all of my sewing stuff and all of my making stuff is still packed away. Are you sick of me talking about moving yet? Because I'm sorry. <laughs> let's get on with the hair content. A few months ago, I found this lovely lady on Instagram and TikTok, Scarlett O'Hare. She had this TikTok where she tried a bunch of methods of heatless curls for her very beautiful long locks. And so I thought, you know, the current state of my hair is, hold on, give me a second. This was not as slick as I thought it was gonna be. Uh, it's a coming. It's quite long somehow. I guess that's what happens when you don't actually register the last two years in your brain. Time really flies when you still think it's 2019. I am a little bored with it. I also am too afraid to cut it all off. So, and yes, it needs to be brushed. Judgeth me if you must. <laughs> kind of boring and uh, a little bit wavy, which is how I would also describe the act of fishing. <laughs> We're going to try five methods of heatless curls. I'm gonna start with what I usually do, which is foam rollers, just to show you kind of what my base is. French braids, something that I used to do all the time in high school and just kind of forgot that that is a thing that you can do. Robe curls, uh, oh no. Does anyone else just not have great control over their pinky? Uh. Number four, flexi rods. Number five, straws. Let us take this hair journey together and, um, Let's get to rolling. Ah, okay. Starting off with foam rollers, which is hard to say. Foam rollers. This is what I usually do. And we're just gonna do the brush out because if you wanna see how I do my roller sets, it has not changed. I am Granny Rachel and I am ready to take out my curlers. I just kinda take these little spagoots out. Pretty simply, we are just gonna brush it out. Ta-da! It's really not all that complicated. As my hair is getting longer, it does take a little longer to roll up, but brushing out is like piece of cake, piece of crumb cake. Hair tour. <laughs> This is sort of my baseline. Disorganized, floofy, cocker spaniel, lady from Lady and the Tramp kind of vibe. Let's try some other methods. So for whatever reason, I decided not to speak during this portion. <laughs> you get voiceover, Rachel. This is pretty straightforward though. I'm just going to use my setting lotion that I use for all my sets, part my hair into two, and then French braid both sides. I had more insightful voiceover to be giving, but, um, <laughs> wow, ain't that neat. The next morning. Good morning. Let's see what we got. I've never been very good at braiding, so I hope these came out okay. <laughs> wow. Tentacles. Hopefully it came out a little more curly rather than Lizzie McGuire crimps. How'd you like? It's not bad. I'm gonna brush it out. This might be a bad idea. Oh, I don't know if I should have done that. Gotta commit. Oh no. Weird Al. Hoomst. I don't hate it. More. <laughs> oh shit. Hermione in the front. Hybrid in the back. Not Leviosa. Ta-da, French braids. Now we know. Moving on. Next, robe 
curls, which I've never heard of. She did was use just ties from two robes that she had. I friggin' love bathrobes. I happen to have two robes right here. So she tied them in the middle and um, I may need some assistance. Teach me, queen. Okay, so she secured it at the top of her head. Kinda uses this as like a braid section. Do some setting lotion, separate it into two. Wait, wrap it all the way around. Me, I'm just in my bathroom whispering sweet nothings to myself all the way around. It's actually easier than I thought it was going to be. That looks cool. One down. <laughs> I'm curious how sleeping with these is going to... Here, what if I hide these together? Mm -hmm. All right, well, we'll see. I'll check in in the morning. Let's see how these babies came out. These were interesting to sleep in, but pretty comfy. Let's give it a shot. Release the noodles. I don't even know how my voice did that. I'm pretty impressed. Serve me up with some Swedish meatballs, honestly. This is probably a bad idea, but I'm curious. So, here we go. What? Great. I don't know if I like this one. I feel like this one's good for long hair because you don't lose that much length. I think maybe if you had like really thick, bountiful hair that this would work, but my hair, there doesn't seem to be a lot of it. So it's just kind of stringy and noodly, reminiscent of a broke college student's diet. Woof. I look good. Flexi rods, like little pool noodles. And then you kind of like go in, maybe? I don't know, we're just gonna go for it, okay? This is truly a journey. I'm fine, I'm a big, brave boy. Oops, whoa. Hmm, <laughs> hair goes nothing, or hair goes nothing. <laughs> okay, wrap it around a couple times and then roll. I think, like, uh, I don't feel confident about that. It's kind of fun. That was really freaking easy. I am quite curious to see how this comes out and excited because if this comes out good, this just might be my new thing. <laughs> These are like really grippy, so your hair doesn't like slip out. I don't want to flex on you, as the kids say, but I can go pretty fast. Wow. Now that I look like Medusa's grandmother, I'm always a little nervous about things coming undone while I'm sleeping, so protect that with a hair scarf. Let us fast forward to the morning. Good morning from me and my grandma robe. Let's see what these look like. I actually have photo shoot today with one of my favorite photographers. So I'm hoping I can get my hair nice and curly for that and that it will stay. So, oh yeah, ready. <coughs> Little Wonder Woman, why are you stuck? Hello? <laughs> I like it, but it's not a huge difference from foam rollers. Kind of the same thing, except maybe a little bit tighter of a curl. Very like unruly kind of curls. 
That'll do, pig. Get it, girl. <laughs> Forgive me, I know this looks like Blair Witch 2. Very spooky. <laughs> it's a new house. I don't have all the lighting figured out yet. All right, whatever. Are you ready to stick some straws in my hair? I'll be honest, folks, I have no idea if this is as literal as I'm thinking. For all I know, there may be a product called hair straws that I'm not aware of, but I tried Googling it and nothing came up. So I'm just gonna treat it like the flexi rods. I'm gonna roll my hair up and like go like that. This is gonna take me 27 years. Okay. One down. I hate this so much. Ouch. I feel like garbage Ariel sticking trash in my hair. Look at this trash. Isn't it neat? Seventy-five years later. I'll see you in the morning. Can't wait to sleep with straws in my hair. Okay, that's very stuck. Let's remove the approximately 3,207 bobby pins. Oh my. I'm going to look like little orphan Annie for that sausage. <laughs> Oh my god. It's like a perfect triangle. This is the kind of Christina Aguilera in that Moulin Rouge music video that I'm talking about. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> I kinda like it. My hair's it's full of secrets. You could hold the entirety of the Freemason history just in this hair alone. <laughs> Wrap up time. Well, that was fun. Hopefully you also had fun watching me sort of self-indulge <laughs> and just play with my hair. I can't say that I walked away with this with a new favorite method. I think they all kind of have their own different uses. Might put this one in my back pocket. If I really need dramatic poodle hair, the effort that it took I don't think is worth it. And also my hair probably thoroughly despises me right now because of this. Who's got split ends? Not me. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I had fun anyways. Like I said, I've just been a little bit bored with my long hair and I just wanted a couple new ways to try to zhuzh it up a little. <laughs> Make sure that you go check out Scarlett O'Hare's Instagram and TikTok. She is amazing. This whole video is thanks to her, so. But yeah, that is it. I'm hoping to have a new house tour up in the very near future, if not next week. So keep an eye out for that, I guess, if you want. I love you, whether you're new or old to this channel. If you're new here and you feel like sticking around, feel free to subscribe. I upload most Fridays and we have fun here. <laughs> wow. And I will see you in my next video. Bye. The girl's got rhythm. Move over, Nick Cannon. Drumline two. Okay. First, yeah. I forgot the next time I wore this, I was going to snip these off. Cause I sound like a house cat. Education. Ah, snack. I'm a snack.